All right, looks like the uh, volume turned out good. Hold on. All right, so sometimes whenever I um, press the pot, I think it's whenever I press the one button to record. So with that being said, let me adjust something. What's going on? Quick save. Take a screenshot. Mouse look. Talk about third person camera. Character editor. Oh yeah, that's right. For the that's one thing I wish this game had is the ability to actually customize your character. Up down, da, 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 okay. Cancel. So, never mind. Nothing I can do about it. Hey, the password for your computer is Sunrise. Keep your cash in the drawer. It's yours. Shock to you an email with my address. Come on over. After you get settled. Why am I talking like William Shatner? Anyways. Z. See? Ah, so, at your convenience, please come and visit me in my home downstairs, downstairs, downtown. I'll leave you this to guide you. Your dark blood, our curse. I like this verse. Such power I sense in one so young. Come find me with where it burns the mystical sun. Imstrauss, trim your regions. So he, we'll, we'll, we'll uh, meet him later. All right, so let's check our emails. Email. Sunrise. But the sun don't shine. Wait, that should make no sense. Reminder, Mercurio will contact you when you arrive in Santa Monica. Waste no time in meeting with him. Sebastian. Penis enlargement. Watch the girls come running. Call today. 1-800-555-SHTICK. Delete. Looking for that lazy-ass ex-husband who's late on his alimony payments? How about that jerk who knocked you up? Look no further. Arthur Kilpatrick's amazing crime pewter. You can find almost anyone with a record. And these days, that's just about anyone. So come on down to Arthur Kilpatrick's Bail Bonds. If you've got the de the deadbeat, we've got the technology to find him. All right, next. That's actually a thing we're going to go visit. Hey, welcome to town. Come on over to my place. Once you get situated, oh, this is Mercurio's. The game begins upon his move. Do you want to play a game? All right, so escape, escape, escape. Or I could just hit Q. All right, so in here, we have blood. Mm, blood. Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Alright, so I got the watch. The normal watch, which can sell for a little bit of money. Ooh, paper. It's the word in town. Carnival of death. Gruesome remains found in the pier. Police baffled. Baffled police are baffled. Violating the masquerade by revealing aspects of supernatural existence, humankind puts you at risk of ambush by human vampire hunters. Oh, snap. Hey, hey, lady. You, you got some change, lady? You hungry? I am too. Hmm, we do seem to be all alone in this. Oh, well, let's see here. Hmm, hmm. Let's see. Yep, yep, over here. Alright, come here, you. <laughs> Yummies. F, don't really get much blood out of him, but oh well. God, I really did use a lot of my blood. Alright, so. Stay safe. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Which. Okay, I'm like moonwalking sideways. Yeah, the animations in this game are going to be a little awkward at times. Oh, somebody's not doing too well. Three guesses to who that is. Hey, what's up there, guy? You can haggle him for money, but that comes later. Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Hope this is not Chris's blood. Chris is our old partner, you know. She cannot wait to do the Let's Play of uh, the remake, which I got. Sure hope this blood isn't from my teammates. Richard, what happened? Those mothers ripped me off. Ugh, I'm dying here. Well, this is why we can't have nice things, because you decided to trust a nun. I told you, don't trust the nuns. Uh, yeah. You looking for the astrolite? I'm... Oh, I can feel a draft on my fucking insides. They shanked me. The bastards. The blood ain't working no more. My head, it feels cracked. Oh, I think my eyes popped. Man, what kind of nuns were you doing business with? Stay with me. What happened? I got... I went... Uh, what is this lump? Is this my rib? Oh, holy shit. My rib is poking through my side? Oh, I'm all numb. You gotta look and tell me. Cut the crap and tell me who did this or I'll finish the job. Wow, that's a dick thing to say. Yep, that's a rib. That's how you got about five minutes to live. Goddamn chemist. Can't trust any operators in L.A. I verified him. Organization seem reliable. Guy mixes up speed, his crew sells it. Occasionally does explosives. I set up a drop. I show up at the beach with the money, right? 
Four of these guys, they come out of nowhere. Junky pricks, hit me with a bat. <coughs> it feels like I got a friggin' horse kick in it. Those <laughs> cocksuckers beat me rotten, left me for a stiff. I had to crawl to my car, crawl my ass up here. The vamp blood's the only thing holding me together. But shit, they got the money, they got the astrolite. So basically, you done fucked up. You idiot, the prince will hear about this. Vamp blood? Where are the bastards? Those small-time sons of bitches live out in a dump on the beach. Four or five of them. And one's got the explosives is Dennis. Got my money, too, that prick. How do I get there? Laying in a pool in my own blood, and you want friggin' directions. Right, all right. Uh, down the street, in the parking garage, stairs down to the beach. On the right. <clears throat> Those better not be some of my last words. No, you, any, or anything else? You gotta... You gotta get it back from him. Maybe reason with him, maybe break in. I don't know. I wanna kill him. Do whatever you people do. I blew it, I know. Is there anything I can do to help you, though? There's a little tidbit yeah, you can do if for you him. you could... Oh, something just started leaking. Got a tingle? I need something for the pain. Um, I'll bring something back. Uh, one more thing. About the deal. I mean it. You tell anyone about this, I'm dead. I'm begging you. I got a way of getting people what they need. You don't say anything. I can help you out. Good to know. Goodbye. All right, now you're going to play dead. Now, our courier is actually one of the people that's like 100% loyal to you, so yeah, I'm definitely going to help. Plus, I got a lot of things I can do with the hospital. A lot of things to do, see? Masquerade areas have maps located on bus stops. Did I read that right? I don't even know. Somebody rewind the video and tell me if I read that right. My mouse is acting all funky. Anyways, hospital. Let's go here. Oh man, you! Oh god, you! You're a vampire, aren't you? What? No. Uh, what are you smoking? Come on, you are too. Oh man, don't bullshit me, girl. Just come clean. I ain't gonna tell no one. It's okay. I just wanna talk. Well, can you talk in a quieter voice? You're not really being subtle here. Hell yeah! Oh man, I knew it. I just... Oh jeez, I knew you were. I just could tell. I... Oh man, this is great. And I saw your teeth, and, and I was like, damn, it was like I could just sense you. Spider senses it's tingling. Harrington. Pleasure to meet you. Or spidey senses. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> the drugs are totally kicking my ass right now. <laughs> yeah, this guy's a bit eccentric. Um, Are you a vampire? How do you know all this? Uh, Pleasure to all yours. Leave me alone, jackass. I'm a ghoul. What? I didn't know about any of this stuff until a couple of months ago. When this guy just appeared, and, well, all of a sudden, bam! Oh, man. Oh, that man. guy's a real and right there in front of my eyes. Blew my goddamn mind. I'm sure something else blew your mind before that with the way you're talking. You said you're a ghoul. What is that? Did you not read? Well, the way it was explained to me, whenever a vampire lets a human drink some of their vampire blood, the human gains a little vampire power. Can heal up quick and that kind of stuff. Jeez, oh, man. And jeez, oh, man. Ooh, ooh watch out. <laughs> ooh, watch out. So, uh, you seem to enjoy it. It's awesome! Man, after that first date of vampire blood, it's like the best drug. Oh, man, I'm telling you, it's like... Well, it didn't mess me up. It just made me feel like I was better at everything. I felt like a god just sucking on that nasty dude's wrist. Uh, so what are you doing around here? Well, look, I probably shouldn't tell you this, but I'm on a secret mission for my master. Oh? Well, hey! <laughs> it's been great talking to you, man. But I better be going. Oh, man! You know, important stuff to do. <laughs> uh, has anyone ever told you you're an idiot? So you're, actually, he's not an idiot. He's actually really fucking smart. Um, and I'm, I'm not even just saying that either. Um, we'll find, you'll find that out later, though. As we, uh, progress further down the game. Or press, progress further through the game. Yeah. Alright, so, we got three experience, and I'm going to use it. Uh, let's see. Which I think I want to. Find right, persuasion at persuasion at four. So it's where I want it, anyways. For all unarmed, I don't really care to improve my unarmed defense. Three intimidation, don't care to improve that. Stealth, security, lock picking. Uh, I could wait. Yeah, I think I'll just wait for a bit. All right, so at five. You there. Please, wait your turn and you'll be seen. Please, wait your turn and you'll be seen. I'm here to work on the network repairs. Nobody told me to expect any technicians. Well, nobody told me to expect any stupid bitches. Guess we both got ripped off. Um, let's see here. Well, your driver complex has a security nagle in the IP routing matrix. Fine, whatever. 
Here's the key for the second floor. Stairs are down the hall. Tell the guard upstairs you're here to work on the network. Will do. Thanks. I will. Goodbye. I just hope I'm. In, I just hope I'm in time to salvage the. Uh, un, what? Univi un, Unifb server. All right. Whatever. Anyways. Uh, let's see. Let's go in here. Cause there is a girl. Uh, uh, police. Get a doctor. Hold on. Ah, my insides. It hurts so bad. That's... Yeah, I'm not going to go I'm there. sorry, miss, but you're going to have to wait outside like everyone else. No exceptions. No exceptions. But there's a girl over there, and I think she's going to die. See here now. I'm the only physician here at the moment. we got twice as many people as usual waiting for treatment. I'll look at her as soon as possible. Uh, try to talk to her. Keep her awake. But... I've got a man in there with a bullet in his head. So, the basically, he's dead. Dr. Roberts a half hour ago. He'll be here any time. Oh, nope, he's, he's alive. alive. Stay with your friend and make sure she doesn't go into shock. Uh, Whoa. Let's go. <laughs> okay, I've seen I've seen some weird shit, man. Anyways, you <laughs> can someone call my grandma, please? Stay with me just a little longer. Uh, mm, All right, so you gotta close the door. Uh, uh, All right, she's gonna do this whole. Oh, I'm in pain. It hurts. Oh, uh, <laughs> make the pain go away. That's what I'm trying to do. If you just let me talk, game. Uh, 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 <laughs> Yes, yes. Beat her some of your blood. Ooh, yes, drink. <laughs> Look at her eyes, are like everywhere, like, oh yeah. Oh, drink, drink. Uh, uh, <laughs> How you feeling? That'll be 500 bucks. <laughs> hey, we got some humanity. You all right? You like that? Best cure in the world. You... Mm, boy, who... Uh, who are you? Oh, what did you do? What did you do to me? <sighs> Fed you the nectar of my people. Nothing, I must be going now. I simply wanted to help. But you did something. I, I kissed your wrist. I can feel it inside of me. What did you do? Now, you can tell her that you're a vampire and all that jazz, but if you do, she's going to be like, Oh my god, a vampire! Help me, somebody! Uh, look, forget about this. Don't say anything. You'll be fine. You. I feel like I know you. No, you don't. Like you've always been here. No, I haven't. Yeah, you can say, I'm a vampire. My blood healed you, but I really must be going now. Say nothing about our encounter. Goodbye, my child. All right, now... We can go into this room. Oh, yeah, there's nothing in this room. Ah, door! Attacking me! Oh wow, you can open you can open both ways. Now you can go in here. I believe the password to this one is Lakers in case I can't uh, hack it. Email, enter, control C. And we get the password. Oh, I have a skill of three, wow. Didn't realize that. A little help. Hey Danny, I could use a little help down here. Can you go up to the controlled substances for some morphine? Hint. I'm pretty busy right now, thanks. Next. No, it's not for my personal use, you bastard. Smiley face. I didn't know they were out upstairs. Maybe you can get some in Malcolm's office. By the way, your mother wears combat boots. f dog. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Anyways. Um, oh shit, that's cold. But I'll go make sure to knock before I go in. I'd hate to catch him in the middle of a pelvic examination. Wink, wink. By the way, tell your mom to stop calling me f dog. Uh, quit. And then you can look at personnel or... It Gives you a little rundown of some of the people that work here. Nothing too interesting. Uh, room four. Oh yeah, pills. Hey, drugs. Pills here. Grabbing pills. All right, so now we can go. I believe we gotta go upstairs. Yeah. To um, get access to some things. All right, this you there. This area is for hospital staff only. Uh, I'm here to fix the network. Nurse downstairs told me to talk to you. You can always seduce him. Uh, patience. Control C. Yeah, but we're not going to get it. Um, let me see. Actually, hold on. Is it aspects? Here's my wits, I believe. My wits is key to hacking. All right, so. Uh, patience. 
see. Hippo crates. Enter. Poe Kilpatrick Marsh Barber. H. Okay. H. Poe. Diagnosis ruptured organs, lacerations, internal bleeding condition critical. A. Kill. Petri. Severe tinea infection compounded by two untreated herpes. All right, so this guy's got STDs. All right, so CS door. Control C. Well, schnitt. All right, so again. CS door. Ah, oh, damn it. CS. Err. CS door. C. CS cabinet. Damn it! Oh well. Um, unlock. Door unlocked. Okay. Again. CS door. Oh, whoops. Unlock. Okay. CS cabinet. Control C. Money. Okay. Um, no. So, cabinet unlock, control substance, camera enabled for your security, enter, okay. I just went ahead and unlocked everything. Figured why not. Uh, maintenance, that's where I need to get into. Security guy at. Yep, I need to feed. And we drop down here, yoink. Actually, I can go feed on that Malcolm guy here in a bit. Boink. Malcolm's office key. Then we're gonna haggle this guy for some money. Morphine. Alright, email. Control C. Tonight. Malcolm, are you free tonight? I thought you could swing by my apartment after your shift. You still don't have you, you still don't make house calls, don't you, doctor? I have something that needs checked out. Paige. This is Paige from WWE. Do I really have to ask twice? Or it could be one of the Charm Sisters. Who knows? Um anything if you don't want. But I really need to do something. I, ah fuck it. You know what it says. You guys can read. <sighs> Show you my appreciation. You just have to ask. Malcolm, do you think you'll be able to get a day off next week? My mother's coming into town on Thursday. I bought a new mattress and some new curtains for the guest room. Some of that shit green and purple? Yeah, it is. Or pink? Whatever. Anyways. So yes, Malcolm is cheating on his wife with one of his uh, nurses, aka Paige. I think that's the chick up front. Um, he's in the... No, he is right here. What's up, guy? I, told you, I will get to you when I can. Please take a seat. You, Malcolm? Your wife know about your affair? Get out of here. Can't you see I'm with a patient? Divorce is expensive. All I'm asking is for a few bucks. I guess you don't care if your wife finds out then. Are you trying to blackmail me? Yep. You don't know who my wife is. She wouldn't believe you. Now get out. Then I'll go forward that email from Paige to Trina at sol.vtm. Wait now. What do you want? 75 bucks. Deal. But I'm in the middle of something. I'll have to drop it off later. Now never speak to me about that again. Put it in the mailbox for 508 apartments to over in the pawn shop, doctor. And, oh yes, and I also want some of your blood, so come here. Alright, thank you. Thank you for your time. Alright, so, got a little bit of blood. I uh, don't think I need to go downstairs for anything. Whoops. Oh wait, actually, I do need to go back upstairs, though. We need to get into the. Yeah, it's this room right here. It's got the camera on. Yeah, so I'm just gonna wait for him to kind of disappear. <laughs> Maybe I could do this. No valid target found. All right, just wander off. 
he decides to get all hissy fitty. Uh, okay, so yeah, the camera's in the right room. What's up, guy? Ah, damn it. Come here. Whoa. <laughs> I knocked him into the room through the door. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, that's impressive. Alright, I didn't want to kill him, but oh well, shit happens. Am I gonna need blood buff? I'm probably gonna need blood buff for this. Damn it. Um, crap. Because you can get money for that. Well, actually, if I'm gonna have to kill him, I might as well make the most of it. Hey there. <laughs> Oh yeah, we've already unlocked all that. Then, oh yeah, that's the password to uh, Malcolm's computer. Maintenance, we've already been in there. See, I uh, see, we've already messed with that. Yeah, here's where I need to get into. Oh yeah, that that part comes in later. And we need to get into here. And we take all this crap. So we can sell all of it for money. I'm a small time drug dealer now. I don't think there's anything in the blood bank that we can mess with outright, anyways. I mean, there's this one dude right here you can buy blood from, but eh, it's not worth it. Especially with how much blood you pick up and how easy it is to uh, refuel or refill your blood deal. There's nothing in those two rooms. Terminal. Oh, you can adjust the freezers. Just come until later. That's locked. That's where that one dude's at. That's locked. Oh, come down. Crap right there. Cadavers escape. Another tidbit that comes in later. Yeah, there's not nothing in that. Whoa, shit, I thought that was a guy standing. Like, ah! Can't, can't scare me like that. Bad things happen when you scare me. Right, so now we have an easier access to the morgue through here. Room two is it? Yeah, room two is empty. Alright, blackmail this clown. So, yep, our business here is done. Alright, have a good day, everybody. Well, that's the hospital pretty much cleared. Uh, aside from the occasional revisits, now let me see if I can talk uh, to this guy and haggle yes, with money. Yes, is there something I can um, help you with? What are you doing? Waiting for that blasted tow truck I called an hour ago. I'd rather not wait another second in this part of town this time of night. It's a rather dreadful place, don't you think? I should have listened to my mechanic. By German, he said. Smart mechanic. Terribly sorry to trouble you. My wallet's been stolen. I need to take a cab. Oh, I completely understand. Here, uh, take a few bucks. Think nothing of it. I wouldn't be surprised if in this neighborhood you were pickpocketed. All right. Anyhow, good evening, well, and uh, do be careful. I will. Thank you, sir. So, sounds like a douchebag, but he's actually a nice guy. If you got high enough persuasion, he's a nice guy. Oh, Mercurio? Shit, are you dead? I got you some morphine. 
Holy Christ, I needed that. You're welcome. I'll come back when I get the astrolite. No, we're actually not going to go for the astrolite off the get-go. Yay, humanity gained. There's actually some side stuff we can do first. Anyway, we're going to go head over to Kilpatrick's. And get a quest, a couple of quests from him. Um, and he is... Maybe he's this way. No, 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 he's uh, over here. Over here! Excuse me, sir. Yeah, it's behind the hospital. The asylum. The asylum. He's down the road here. Over where this end of the world guy is. The end is coming! Every second takes us closer to the time of judgment! Woo! Time of judgment gets closer every second! Judgment day! I have seen the face of the demon, and it is excited! Let me jump on your head. Corruption of the soul is pandemic. There is no so let me jump on him. Your true face to the judge of souls. Redemption cannot be bought and sold. There is no mercy for the deviant. We. All right. Anyways, enough of that. Jump on the barrel. Ah, I'm on fire. Fuck. What's up there, guys? Welcome to Kilpatrick 24 Hour Bail Bonds. My name's Arthur Kilpatrick. How can I help you? Well, you run this place, I assume. Yep, sure do. I'm a third generation bondsman. Got Family a few business. employees, but I handle most every aspect of the business. I don't see any employees, Arthur. I gotta have a few other bondsmen to keep the place open 24 hours. Plus a bounty hunter. I pull the graveyard shift because that's when all the crazy shit happens in Santa Monica. Mm hmm. <laughs> Chuckle, chuckle. Um, bounty hunter, no, that sounds like an interesting job. You betcha. I used to do some bounty hunting back in the day. Takes a good solid set of brass balls. Uh, pardon the expression, Missy, but it takes balls to be a good bounty hunter. Sabrina's inner feminism is greatly offended by your masculine comments. Ugh. Anyways, um... Is Bounty Hunter you have now any good? Yep, damn good. His name's Carson, and he's great at what he does when he wants to do it. I can't seem to find him now, though. He's pissing me off, to be honest. I need him to go find someone. I shouldn't say inner feminism. I should say inner feminazi, because there's a distinction between the two. So, I apologize to all feminists out there. Um, can't you find another Bounty Hunter? Well, you know what I mean. Can't you find another Bounty Hunter? Well, I don't feel right cutting Carson loose just yet. We go way back. I knew his father, too. Tell you what, since I'm stuck here, why don't you go look for him? Just real quick. I'll pay you for your time. All right, I could do that. Um, where should I look for him? Great, great. I suppose the first place you should look is his apartment in Santa Monica Suites. Apartment one, I think it is. Maybe you'll find something there to let you know where he's got himself to. Here's a key card. That'll let you in. Before I go, could you answer a question? Oh, actually, no. I'll tell him. See you later, Arthur. All right, anyway. I don't think there's anything here to grab. I turned off your radio. <laughs> no radio for you. All right, so I gotta check my inventory. And I got all that crap to sell. Carson's apartment key. Oh yeah, so he's got to sell my Carson's. And he lives where uh, what's his face is. The Lord's love. The damned laugh loudest before they lose their head. <laughs> Anyways. Um, there goes this way. And that's the building right there, I believe. Yep, it is. Many factors contribute to your defense and combat. Which reminds me, there are four. All right, turn this thing check, on. Check. This thing on Cash. God, I hate it. That's right, you can't use them in the Elysium. There was no sign of McGee. I'm going to follow up on another lead I got to. I updated the files on the computer. This is Carson signing off. Man, that sounds stupid. Let's see. 
Himalaya. Okay. Location. The key is hiding in the tattoo parlor in Santa Monica. And then key, which I just picked up and it's on top of the TV. Escape. And if you want to know who Amalia is, oops, she's right there. Anyways. In the next video, folks, we're going to go to the tattoo parlor and see if we can find this uh, McGee fellow. And Carson, of course. Thirteen known clans, of which you can only play about seven. So, in the next video, folks, I will see you then.